But how do crystals heal? Crystals work at an energy level. They have the ability to store, generate, and give off electromagnetic energy. And because of their special geometric internal makeup, crystals are able to tap into universal energy patterns and frequencies, thereby changing those patterns to be redirected for man's purposes. In the field of vibrational medicine, it is known that we have not only a physical anatomy, but we also have what is called a subtle body as well. This is made up of three components, the aura, chakras, and the meridians. Conventional medicine did not recognize these anatomies until very recently. The word aura comes to us from the Greek. Chakra comes to us from ancient East Indian medicine, while knowledge of the meridians comes to us from Chinese acupuncture. The aura's energy can be depleted or become unbalanced by inside or outside influences, from thinking negatively to eating the wrong foods or absorbing radiation from computer screens. Crystals and gemstones exert positive healing energies that renew our bodies as they resonate with the energy of the aura. Chakra is a Sanskrit word which means wheel. The chakras are like wheels of energy that are connected to the glands of the endocrine system. The seven major chakras act as transformers which step down high energy from the outside to subtle energy forms which the body can handle for its own use on the inside. This energy affects the glands. The glands in turn produce chemical, hormonal, and cellular changes which influence the body, emotions, and spirit, the psyche of an individual. The crystals therefore have a holistic effect. The acupuncture meridian system in conjunction with the chakras take in higher vibrational energies that are just as integral to the proper growth and maintenance of physical life as the digestive system. Each crystal has its own particular energy which vibrates at a level that can have a specific healing effect on mind, body, emotions, and spirits. They can soothe, stimulate, open, and align ground or clear accordingly. So how can you access the therapeutic benefits of crystals? Crystals and stones can be laid on the body in gemstone therapy. They may be carried in a pocket or worn as jewelry to help you maintain mental clarity, emotional stability, and physical balance. The latter is one of the most simple and effective ways of utilizing their healing force. It should be noted here that metals have a unique purpose when worn as jewelry. Gold, silver, copper, hematite, and pyrite are all cubic structured raw elements. When skin melanin, perspiration, and these metals combine, they convert into metabolic energy for the body. An ionic exchange occurs when electrolytes within sweat come into contact with metals used for adornment. Melanin then absorbs the ions exchanged in the process and turns them into food for the body.